Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol GEVO. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. I'm not sure what I mean by 30 minute. I do offer an explanation video at that link. Well, a, a relatively anticlimactic day today, and I, I, I assume I'm stating the obvious when I say that. I mean, when you factor in, let's just quickly do that. When you factor in that that's how the chart looked like closing on Tuesday, and then things just gapped down and then really didn't do much the entire day. I mean, it did consolidate nicely. Unfortunately, though, it did roll back over here. Um, and I should note that I'm not saying that there's anything wrong with the chart per se. I'm just saying it was a bit anticlimactic just compared to how crazy that price action actually was. And for this, I wanna really just apply the KISS method here, keep it simple, stupid, and focus really on two main levels. So the first main level from the support side of things is a very well-known level, that being the purple line down there, the 50 period simple moving average. And that's one of those areas where even if you have a very basic understanding of charts, technical analysis, I'm sure you've heard of that level before. And you know that, you know, generally speaking, you wanna see the price stay up above that area. So that is why just from a very, you know, keep it simple, stupid perspective, let's just watch that level because as long as the price is above that, you know, general trend indicator, then that does still imply that the general trend is bullish. And then the other flip side of things is I'm just gonna go ahead and adjust this level down here. So yes, up here at that area where the, the, the momentum stopped on Tuesday around $1.17, that is indeed a level of resistance. But now that we have more data after, whoops, after today's price movement, the main level to watch going forward is now gonna be right here at that high of $1.07. So yes, $1.17 without doubt still is a level of resistance. But like I said, with all the data we had today, and I mean, there's just a bunch of data points where the price would get right up around that area and could never quite build any more, you know, sort of further momentum. So watch that area as the main area of resistance moving forward. But all in all, yeah, a very anticlimactic day, which again, doesn't mean that the entire chart's destroyed, but uh, not exactly what I would have thought would have happened. Uh, but we'll see what happens with it on Thursday and Friday. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.